Hi everybody, welcome to my infrared sauna vlog. Um, it's, I've been here over 10 minutes and it's over 130 and I'm literally dripping, but, um, and it feels great. It feels really good. So, but today I wanted to talk about a really important topic and that is, are you a creator or are you a victim? Okay, because there are really only two ways to be in this dimension that we live in, the earth plane. And the cool thing is that when, when we incarnate here, what we're given as a gift from the creator is free will. And the point of that is to be forced to choose, you know, be forced to choose whether we're going to come from a place of love and manifest everything that we ever wanted in our lives or are we going to come from a place of fear and be a victim okay so that's huge that's really important because once you grasp grasp that concept of being a creator or a victim coming from love or fear in everything you do and every thought you have and every thing that you do and every reaction that you have coming from a place of love or fear being a victim or a creator everything will change because once you get that concept you can no longer blame others because you know conceptually that it's your responsibility right it's your responsibility okay so if you are a creator right Everything you do comes from a place of love, right? If you're in a bad circumstance because of, say, for example, the fires, right? We didn't have any control of those fires. But you do have control of how you're going to react from those fires. You can stay in a place of despair. You can stay in a place of mourning. Or you can say, I'm going to take this experience. I'm going to learn from it. I'm going to give thanks and praise to all of my blessings that I still have, even if they're the simplest things, like I'm still alive and you're going to move forward from a place of love. Okay. And forgiveness. But if you're a victim, regardless of your circumstances, you're going to blame everything and everybody and just continually be stuck because you're not taking responsibility for your creatorship, right? When you blame other people for whatever, your circumstances, your situation, whatever it is, you're not taking responsibility. And the reality is we're all responsible for where we are in this life in any given moment. Okay, so huge concept, like one of the biggest concepts you'll ever grasp in your life if you wanna manifest abundance beyond your wildest expectations be a creator be responsible for every thought every word that comes out of your mouth every decision that you make every reaction that you have be the creator of your life right I'm dripping oh my god it's like literally dripping <laughs> thank god it's the weekend woohoo okay but if you're a victim right you're gonna remain stuck Blaming everybody for whatever it is you're dealing with. Blaming the world because you're so unhappy. Really, you're in charge of your happiness. You're in charge of how you think. You're in charge of your emotions. You're in charge of wherever you are today in your life because of all the decisions, thoughts, actions, and reactions that you had till this point. Okay? Huge concept. Most people don't want to grasp that concept because that means that from that moment on, they have to be responsible. They can't blame anymore if they understand that concept. So simple as that, right? So are you gonna come from a place of love and be a creator and manifest everything you want in your life? Or are you gonna remain stuck in a place of fear and blame and not being responsible for what you have created okay simple concept vastly important to your long-term happiness right a biggie 
Okay, so I hope that you all take that into the weekend and take it into your heart and understand that you can change your life for the better in ways you couldn't even imagine just by being responsible for your thoughts, actions, reactions, and everything you do in this world, in this dimension, in this lifetime. <laughs> it's easy to fall that wagon, baby. But keep that in mind. It may take a minute to really fully grasp it. But once you do, everything's going to change. And you won't believe how amazing it is. I mean, amazing. <laughs> Literally, I'm dripping. And that's why I wear these little tops and whatever. Because it's raining. I'm raining sweat, man. Just detoxing like crazy. So it's, it's, I got about 45 minutes or so and I'm going to meditate. I'm going to um, give thanks and praise for all of my blessings. And I'm going to pray for everyone to come from their heart and to give thanks and to know that they're loved unconditionally by the universe, unconditionally cared for by the universe. And all we have to do is own our power. Okay. So I'm sending blessings to all of you from my heart to yours, and keep that in mind this weekend, and woo, peace. <laughs>